Hello, this is Hakka Bean, and today we are going to be going over SCP-14-J, also known as a fork. If you like this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Now let's get right into this. I have number SCP-14. After class Ketter, special containment procedures. SCP-14's holding cell is to remain and locked at all times. Personnel of sufficient clearance as determined by facility administrator may be admitted to view SCP-14 after submitting a formal request three weeks in advance. Anyone handling SCP-14 must undergo special precaution a protocol 14-2. All personnel re exposed to SCP-14 must be subsequently subjected to a 48 our quarantine and psychological evaluation, and after exposure, common sense dictates that one should wash your hands. Description SCP-14 takes the form of an antique dinner fork, well-worn and as near as can be estimated, not clean since the 1890s. The object is fashioned from the electroplated nickel-silver typical of the expected and period of its manufacture. And the rightmost time is bent redacted degrees outwards. Brown stains and mold adorn the prongs and the pits of the decorative part of the candle. A nose of this material seems to indicate that S314 was last used on some form of beast, Eve. S314 was moved to this facility in the early 1970s and seems for all intents and purposes to be an entirely mundane dinner fork. If it is possessed of any extraordinary qualities, these are known only to those in the very highest echelon of the projects of this project's coordinators, whose representatives assure us that SCP-314 is quote very important. Officers who have spent time alone with SCP-14 are unanimous in, in their appreciation of the object is of great significance, hence its continued presence at this site. The none can see quite why. See testimony of Major Redacted, February in 1972. No tests on SCP-14 are authorized. Any personnel all observed attempting to compromise SCP-14 in any way are to be terminated at once. Note: I request that we have this SCP decommissioned immediately. It's too dangerous to be kept alive. Agent Spoon. <laughs> I see the joke they did there. No. Request denied. There is no evidence of any immediate threat. O5 unknown. That was SCP 14J. A fork that's been marked as Ketter. Despite it literally doing nothing. This actually has been um, re referenced in, a f in one uh, of the most popular documents that is no longer available on the site because it's relating to a character made by an admin that has since been removed from the SCP wiki. I did, however, read this document before it got taken down because it was incredibly funny. Anyway, if you liked this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. I have no idea what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, so until then, goodbye!